Hey there YouTube, what's going on? This is Anthony coming to you on a Thursday night. I uh, just wanted to give you guys a quick update on my Cory Fry. Uh, and also, um, give you guys a look at some new fish that I just got in. Uh, since we're already there, I'll start you off with the Cory Fry. Um, they have gotten much bigger. This one here in the corner is actually probably the biggest one. Um, I just moved, recently moved them into this uh, breeder box for the time being um, because I'm going to need their little quarantine tank. Uh, but they're doing well, they're eating well, definitely gaining in size. Uh, I ended up with uh, four uh, Buenos Aires Tetra Fry that had snuck in. Um, they've gotten big enough where I put them in the main tank now. Um, they're most likely hiding within the weeds here, um, just because the adults do chase them a little bit, but they um, they hold their own. Uh, chances are I probably won't see any right now. Um, yeah, they're they're hiding in there now. Um, but yeah, uh, so that's what's going on there, uh, and I will now take you over to the box of new fish I got in, and we'll open that up. Alrighty guys, so here we have the already open box, uh, just because I know that nobody wants to see tape being pulled out. So, we'll just get right to it. Um, in here, this is a fish, fish I've been trying to get my hands on for a Well, researching for a while and finally got my hands on them. They're Amazon Puffers. Um, I ordered three of them and they sent me one extra, just in case. But they're they're in really good condition. They're really looking good. Um, so yeah, there's another two in there, and then in this bag in here. Let's see if I can get that. I have six. Let's see, they're hiding in the corners of the bag. There we go. Uh, six sparkling garamis, uh, also known as croaking garamis. Um, they're nice, nice, quaint little fish. Uh, they're probably gonna go into my nano tank. Um, but yeah, these are really great. I ordered these from um, Batfish Aquatics. Uh, I'll post a link to their webpage down below. Um, they're really great. They um, they really keep uh, Joshua over there. Really keeps in contact with you and uh, kind of kept me in the head in the heads up um, every step of the way. But yeah, I'll go ahead and uh, turn this off right now and get them into their little quarantine setup. Alrighty, so everybody is set up in quarantine now. Uh, I've got the four puffers, one, two, three, and fours up there and I've got the six garamis in here as well they're in a little um, breeder net some floating plants just to give them some cover um, yeah so far everything looks okay um, I'm a little concerned about this guy it looks like he might have a little bit of a swim bladder issue um, but I'll just medicate this the setup and um, Hopefully everybody makes it through anything they might have, but uh, this guy here at the right and uh, this guy here coming into frame here in the middle now, um, they seem to be doing the best. Um, I actually kind of see them sculpting around the tank and almost doing a little bit of hunting behavior. Uh, I've got plenty of snails in here for, uh, for them when they kind of start eating those. Um, but yeah, uh, everybody looks good. Can't wait to get them through quarantine. Of course, patiently. Um, get them through quarantine, make sure everything's good. Um, and then get them into their main setups. I'll keep you guys posted. Uh, thanks for watching and uh, have a great, uh, well, have a great Friday and a great weekend.